Earlier we looked at creating quick parts for inserting regular used text. For example, if I type decorating team and press the function key F3, this inserts my decorating team smart art diagram. If I then type logo and press F3, this is my quick part for the logo. When it comes to managing quick parts, you need to know about the building block organizer. For example, on the insert tab in the ribbon and in the text group, you have the quick parts button. When you click the quick parts button, you can either right click a quick part or you can choose the building blocks organizer. The building blocks organizer will give you a list of all the built in quick parts as well as the ones you've created. For instance, when you look at making headers and footers, the fact that you have a gallery of styles is because of the building blocks, and the same with cover pages. If you wish to quickly sort your list, you can click these column headings. If I click the column heading name, I've sorted my quick parts by name. If I hit it again, I've sorted them in descending order. I can also sort my quick parts by gallery, and that all my cover pages are together, all my footers are together, and then all my headers are together. If I click on Name and I press the key D on my keyboard, I'll jump to those quick parts that begin with D. And this includes my quick parts like Decorating Cover, Decorating Document and Decorating Team. If I want to delete a quick part, then the quickest thing is to click on the quick part like Decorating Team and hit the Delete button. This will delete a quick part. It asks for my confirmation as to whether I do want to delete it, so I click Yes. So if you want to delete a quick part, use the Building Blocks Organizer. If you wish to um, insert a quick part, such as cubicles, then I'll click the Insert button. And this inserts the cover page, Cubicles. Anything to do with managing quick parts is done in the Quick Parts button and in the Building Blocks Organizer.